I've tested numerous AI text-to-video generators, and after extensive trials, I've concluded that this one is the absolute best for creating faceless channels, especially those that utilize stock footage available online. Let me introduce you to NVIDIA AI. In this video, I'll provide a detailed review on how to use NVIDIA AI to create a faceless video in the fitness niche. Why fitness? Take a look at the Body Hub channel with over a million subscribers and videos raking in millions of views. They're earning close to $8,000 a month just from ad views and potentially much more from affiliate links promoting fitness products. Notice how they don't need to show their faces. They use AI generated voices and carefully selected stock footage, all powered by AI technology. I'm going to guide you through the process of creating a video just like this using NVIDIA AI. From building a perfect prompt structure to detailed editing techniques, I'll help you craft a polished video. In particular, in the fourth part of this video, I'll show you how to seamlessly blend AI generated footage with your own, making your videos incredibly engaging, just like BodyHub does. This combination will set your video apart from typical fitness content, giving it a more professional edge, driving up views, and ensuring it's 100% monetizable. YouTube will recognize the effort you've put into the video, rather than just seeing it as another AI-generated piece. Let's get started. Part 1. Optimizing the prompt to create a video. We'll begin creating this video with NVIDIA AI. First, head over to the NVIDIA AI website. I've included the link in the video description and pinned comment. Follow the simple steps to register for a free account with NVIDIA AI. Here, I've already logged into my NVIDIA dashboard. Once logged in, you'll be directed straight to the main window to create a video. Make sure you're using the latest version. Next is the NVIDIA prompt window, where we'll type in a prompt to instruct NVIDIA on what to create. The first step is having a solid idea for the video. To generate ideas, I'll reference the BodyHub YouTube channel. Let's check out their latest videos. I'm selecting this one, 10 anti-aging exercises, which garnered over 40,000 views in just one month. I'll create a similar video using NVIDIA, but for this demo, I'll focus on the first five exercises they feature. I've crafted an optimized prompt template for you to create a video, which you can find in a Google Doc linked in the description. Let's walk through this prompt I've prepared. First, we need a topic, the main subject we want AI to generate the video on. Next is the desired video length. With five exercises, I estimate the video to be around five minutes long. Then specify the video type as a YouTube upload. Here, I'll describe the structure of the video I want. I'll instruct the AI to create an intro like this one. For the main content, I'll have the AI discuss five exercises, squats, lunges, deadlifts, push-ups, and planks, with each exercise detailed as follows. I want to emphasize that the more detailed your request, the closer the AI will align with your vision, saving you tons of time in post-production edits. I'll also ask the AI to create a detailed outro. Next, I'll specify the desired video style. I'll go with a professional style. For the background music, I'll request inspirational, uplifting background music. For the voiceover, since this is a fitness video, I'll opt for a male strong voice. Now that you understand the basic structure of a prompt for NVIDIA, let's copy it and instruct NVIDIA to create the video. Before clicking generate a video, I want to mention another way to start creating a video. Scroll down to the workflows and plugins section. Here you'll find options to start video creation, such as the YouTube explainer option, where NVIDIA provides a guided start similar to the prompt structure I've shared above. You can copy and paste your pre-prepared elements into this section, though it's a bit more time consuming. Feel free to explore this method as it offers a more detailed way to customize your AI generated video. Now let's return to the prompt window to generate the video from the prompt I pasted here. Click on generate a video. The AI will then ask you three questions. First, audience, who you want to target. Since the video is about anti-aging exercises, I'll choose middle-aged adults. Next is the look and feel section, where I'll select the professional style as requested in the prompt. For the platform, I'll select YouTube. Click continue, and in a few minutes, NVIDIA will analyze your request, select music, generate the voiceover, create a script, choose suitable footage, and boom you'll have a complete video. Now let's review the product created entirely by AI. Let's face it, aging is inevitable. One day you're a young buck cranking out burpees and the next you're wincing as you get out of bed. Your joints start talking to you, your metabolism slows, and you can practically hear your muscles shrinking. But what if I told you that you don't have to go down without a fight? We're talking about anti-aging exercises, people. These aren't your grandma's water aerobics. 
We're talking about movements that challenge your body, build muscle, and keep you feeling young and strong. Stick with me folks, because in this video, I'm breaking down the five most effective anti-aging exercises that'll have you feeling like a new person. We're starting with the king, baby, the squat. This movement is about as primal as it gets. You're telling your body, hey, I can still move like I used to, I can still get down and back up with power, and your body responds by building muscle, increasing bone density, and boosting your metabolism. Now, when I say squats, I'm not talking about those half-assed knee bends some people try to pass off as exercise. Okay, what do you think? The script is engaging, the voiceover is clear and fitting, and the footage selected by the AI is incredibly accurate, over 80%. This is hands down the best AI for selecting the most precise footage compared to other text-to-video AIs on the market. But is the job done? Sure, you could review the video and upload it to YouTube right away, but it might struggle to pull in views. There are still areas that need improvement, such as the background music being too loud in some chapters or some footage not being as visually appealing as it could be. So I'll guide you through some tweaks to make this video even more captivating using NVIDIA. Let's dive in. We have two ways to edit the video. Method one, editing directly with prompts. Method two, manual editing. Part two, editing the video with prompts. Before diving into the details of prompt editing, if you're not satisfied with the initial AI-generated video, you can regenerate it by clicking here. Or you can edit your original prompt to create a new version of the video. Now let's return to the prompt editing window. For the first method, simply tell NVIDIA AI what you want by typing prompts here. Let's review the video to see what needs tweaking. Okay, we don't have subtitles yet, so let's type add subtitle and click generate. Instantly, your video will have subtitles. Cranking out burpees and the next you're wincing as you get out of bed. Your joint. Now back to the first footage. Suppose I want to change this footage. I'll type change first footage and NVIDIA will swap out the first footage for us. If the new footage isn't quite right, I can refine my prompt further. Change footage one in chapter one to footage including seniors, and we'll get a more fitting clip for the video. If you want to revert to the original footage, simply click undo, or you can redo to return to your latest edits. Keep you the muscle, increasing bone. Moving on, in this section there's a music track with vocals. I'll instruct the AI to replace it with an instrumental track. Change background music of this section to upbeat instrumental music. And instantly, we have instrumental background music. Amazing, right? Those half-assed knee bends some people try to pass off as exercise. We're going deep, people. Ass to grass, or as close as you can get. Moving on to the first exercise, squats. I'm not satisfied with the footage, so I'll type, change this footage to other footage of squat. And voila, a much more accurate clip is selected. Continue making similar adjustments for the rest of the video. All right, I've walked you through editing a video with prompts. It's an incredibly simple and user-friendly method, even if you lack advanced video editing skills. Now, let's move on to the next part. Part three, manual video editing. To manually edit, click edit. Here you'll have three editing categories. Edit media, edit script, edit music. Let's start with edit media. Click on any footage. Each clip corresponds to a specific part of the script below, making it easy to visualize. Suppose I want to replace this footage. I want to select a clip that isn't from premium stocks, so I'll untick this option, as NVIDIA's free version doesn't have access to premium footage. And the cheapest paid plan limits you to just 80 clips per month. I'll type here to find another squat clip. Plenty of choices from Storyblocks stock footage. Simple, right? Your job is to check and reselect the footage. Now notice these three little dots on each footage clip. Click here to adjust the clip length as needed and customize the footage display using the settings below. In addition to using the stock footage linked with NVIDIA, you can upload your own media to combine with the AI selected footage. I'll detail this combination in the final part of the video, which will make your video incredibly engaging. Next, let's talk about the edit script section. Here you can fine tune the script generated by the AI. Any edits you make will instantly update the video, just like when you typed a prompt and NVIDIA updated the video in real time. When you click on the media section, you'll see the keywords the AI used to select footage. That's all you need to know. There's no need to alter this part. Your main task here is to carefully review the script and make any necessary adjustments. Finally, let's move to edit music. 
Here you can manually select new music for each section by clicking on a chapter, choosing a suitable track from the options below, and clicking replace, then apply change to swap out the music. You can also adjust the background music volume by clicking here, and drag the volume slider to suit your video. You can even fade the music in at the beginning and out at the end by adjusting the fade in and fade out times here. You can also choose a different section of the track to start playing by specifying the time here. Explore these small details on your own, alright? I've walked you through two methods to edit your video using NVIDIA, allowing you to create a polished final product. Let's move on to the last part. Part 4. Combining your footage with AI-generated footage To make your video more engaging and in-depth, combine your custom footage with the AI-generated clips. Take a look at this script segment. It discusses push-up techniques, and if we only use the basic push-up footage generated by NVIDIA, viewers might not fully grasp the technique you're trying to convey. So, for this technical part, I'll prepare my own footage. Now read the instructional content carefully and we'll gather resources from Google to craft the video. I'll search for images showing the correct push-up starting position as described in the script, along with other necessary images. Then I'll upload them to Canva to create my video segment. On Canva, click Create a Design and select Video. First, I'll select a black background by clicking on Elements and searching for black and white gradient, choosing a graphic and dragging it over. Right-click and select set image as background. Then I'll drag in the image I uploaded to Canva, one showing the correct push-up starting position in vertical format, and another graphic image in horizontal format. The script also mentions keeping the body straight from head to toe, so I'll use a dashed line from Element to illustrate this, changing its color for better visibility. I'll add an arrow to highlight this correct position. For the image, I'll remove the background by clicking on the image, selecting Edit Image, and then BG Remover. I'll apply the same dashed line and arrow to highlight the correct form. I'll position the text at the top to avoid overlap with the video subtitles. Now, the first footage showcasing the correct starting position for push-ups is ready. I'll do the same to create a second clip, comparing the correct and incorrect push-up techniques, providing viewers with a clear visual understanding. Next, download these clips from Canva by clicking Share. Selecting Download, choosing MP4 Video, checking Download Pages as separate files to create two individual videos, and then clicking Download to save them to your computer. Finally, upload these clips to NVIDIA and replace the AI-generated footage. I've also prepared a few more clips for the last exercises in this video, and now let's review the last two exercises, combining the AI-generated footage with our own. We're going back to basics with push-ups. You know, that exercise you dreaded back in gym class? Well, it's time to embrace it because push-ups are a fantastic anti-aging tool. They work your chest, triceps, shoulders, and core, all in one powerful movement. And the best part, you can do them anywhere, anytime. Start in a plank position, hands shoulder width apart, body in a straight line from head to toe. Lower your body down, keeping your elbows close to your sides until your chest touches the floor. Push back up to the starting position. Push-ups are all about building functional strength, the kind of strength that translates to everyday activities. Plus, they improve bone density, boost metabolism, and enhance shoulder health. Last but not least, we have planks. This isometric exercise might look easy, but let me tell you, it's a killer for your core. We're talking abs, obliques, lower back, the whole nine yards. A strong core is essential for everything we do, from walking to standing to simply maintaining good posture. To perform a plank, start in a push-up position, but instead of resting on your hands, lower down onto your forearms. Keep your body in a straight line from head to heels, engaging your core and glutes. Hold this position for as long as you can. Planks are all about building that deep inner strength that supports your spine and keeps you feeling strong and stable. Great, right? Now we have finished editing the video. To download the video, click on Download. With the free version, you will download the video, and there will be a watermark. To not have a watermark, you need to upgrade to the paid version. Click on Continue and wait a moment, and you will have a complete video on your computer. That's all. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like and subscribe for more AI and video creation tips. Your support helps us keep bringing valuable content. See you in the next video.